everybody, welcome to my live stream, my Funko friends. How are we doing tonight? Elizabeth Mazak, Oklahoma Bob, Mama J, Elaine Allen, the Nerd Bar. Hey everybody, welcome, 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 welcome. Hope everybody is having an awesome night, awesome, awesome. Thank you so much everybody for being a part. Um, Yeah. Appreciate it. We're gonna. I'm just gonna give everyone a little bit of time to uh, to get in here. Very much appreciate you guys it's taking time out of your night. Uh, hey, Sarah. Welcome. I hope that you are feeling okay. I hope you're feeling better. Hey, Mama J. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Super appreciate you taking time out of your night. We're gonna have an awesome night. We're gonna have a fun night. If it doesn't already show up in the description, we have... I hope you guys are ready for some giveaways. You guys ready for some giveaways? Because I have about five planned. I have about five giveaways. So hopefully no one's tired yet. That's why I wanted to do it a little bit early. Batman Popster, what's going on, Sean? Tyronosaurus X. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Redneck Diaries, what is up? What's crapping in, people? PWP. Hey, Michael and Faith, what's going on? DJ Funko Hunter. Holy Toledo, guys. My stream only started like a minute and 30 seconds ago, and there's already 15 people in here. Wow. Like, you sure know how to make a guy feel welcome. Oh, my gosh. Ready to play? Awesome. Well, good. Good, good. Because hopefully, ho hopefully, hopefully you guys aren't tired because we have about five giveaways tonight. And the best part of it all is the people that we're shouting out have no idea this is happening. Not a clue. They haven't reached out to me. I didn't reach out to them. These are just channels that are either just starting out channels that I want people to check out and experience with me and people that I want to just help get them to their milestones, guys. So again, we'll give everyone a little bit of time to get in here. So while everyone's kind of getting in, I have an interesting story that happened about five minutes ago. Um, I was charging my laptop in the kitchen and I tripped over the cord and I thankfully caught my laptop before it hit the ground. So uh, we almost didn't have a live stream tonight or I would have had a broken screen doing the live stream. Come hell or high water, I would have made it happen. But I, I kid you not, I was going to grab like a bottle of water off the counter and I forgot that the cord was drooping down from the power outlet and I literally tripped and I said, oh no. And I, I lunged for it. And so I lunged and thankfully I grabbed it. So we would have made this live stream happen. But yeah, it was pretty scary. My heart was racing. So that happened about 10 minutes ago. I had to whew, calm myself down, collect myself. Brian! Popping some pops. What's going on? Who else is in here? Who else have I missed? All right. We've got Jerry Boondock Pops. Welcome. Welcome, Jerry. Happy to have everyone. Thank you so much, everybody, for being in here. Wow. Just phew. thank you, everybody. Adam, beautiful pop. Wow. Thank you so much, everybody. Like I said, you guys sure know how to make a guy feel welcome. Well, I guess we shouldn't really waste any more time because we already have almost about 20 people in here. So first order of business, if we need to crown... A mystery box champion, people. You guys are awesome. Thank you, everybody, for taking part. Four pack Funko Spoon and Fun, Dancer TV. Hey, Adam Beard of Pop. Um, the Nerd Bar. Um, Jerry. Everybody that took part, Dancer TV, Gilbert. So, I think it goes without saying. The community has spoken. We have a winner. So, Jerry, Boondot Pops, my friend. This is yours, my friend. You are the champion. This will be sent your way. However, two people in the community, Mama J and the Funko Hunter, have said to me, and they wanted to pass the message on to you, that we think that you should keep this going. You should do a, you should do a community thing once this arrives to you, whatever you, whatever it may be, whether it's mystery box, whether it's value, whatever it is. So I think that you should issue a challenge when this gets to you. And we should keep this going. And whoever wins that challenge, you should send the belt to them. So I think that'd be a fun little idea. I got to give credit where credit is due. That was Mama J's idea. The Funko Hunter also commented on yesterday's video. Said that we should keep this going throughout the community. I think that'd be awesome. I'd love to see it. Yes, Jerry, the champ is definitely here. So the belt, as well as a few um, extra zesty, extra special goodies that I found yesterday to include in your box will be well on their way. So congratulations to the champion, Jerry Boondot Pops. Thank you so much, everybody. I just thought it would be a nice, fun, neat little way to bring the community together, and it definitely did. It warmed my heart. I watched everybody's videos. Like I said, Jerry, Gilbert, Mama J, Spectre, Four Pack, Funko Food and Fun, The Nerd Bar, everybody that took part. Thank you so much. So like I said, Jerry, 
I would love to see a challenge issued when you get this belt, my friend, and we'll see. Uh, you know I'm already going to take part, absolutely. So I think that'd be a fun, neat little thing to do. So congratulations, Jerry. You are officially the champion. It came down to you and Gilbert, and you won by a landslide. So just thank you, everybody, for taking part. That was super fun. So speaking of wrestling, I found a few things today while I was out. You may or may not have seen on my Instagram. So I found these at the dollar store. They're like wall walkers. That's what it says. So there's a couple of different ones it could be. So there's like Bret Hart, Shawn Michaels, The Ultimate Warrior, Undertaker, Kurt Angle, Ric Flair, Sting. Who else is in there? Macho Man. And then uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. So these are like little wall clingy things. So I bought two. So we're going to dive in and see what we've got. Awesome, Jerry. I'm excited to hear that. I'm excited to hear the challenge will happen. Welcome, everybody, that has come in. If I didn't say hi to you before. So I found these at the dollar store as well. I found these, too. I found these. They're Hasbro. Hasbro Power Rangers. And I got two different ones. So we've got two of the wrestling ones to open. We've got two of these to open. So I figured, you know, mystery. I'm all about a mystery bag, mystery box. So let's dive in and see what we get, guys. But first, before we dive into those, I found this in the clearance section. And because it was considered a Halloween item, I got this for 90% off. And wait till you guys see this. Okay. So this was 90% off because it was Halloween. And I asked customer service that they would take an additional 5% off because of the fact that there wasn't a package for it. Guys, look at this. It's a zombie undertaker with purple flames on his wrist. I got this for three bucks, you guys, because there was no package. And I said, oh, that's a Halloween item. And the lady's like, oh, okay, sure, fine. Obviously, you didn't know anything about wrestling. So this was, I would say this is probably at least a $20 collectible figure maybe marked down to 10 because of it being out of the box but i got it for three at the 90 percent halloween discount so yeah so that's pretty awesome so i am digging that i might put that in the background i also think it's really cool how it's in like a coffin shape i think that's why she gave it to me for the halloween price because i was like oh yeah it's a coffin shape i'm pretty sure it was a halloween toy i don't think she knew anything about wrestling so yeah super cool undertaker figure with the eyes in the back of his head so Wanted to show that you guys got that for three bucks. So again, congratulations, Jerry, transitioning into wrestling. So we got that. So I would love to see the challenge. That belt will be well on its way to you, my friend. So let's start with the wrestling figures. And then we'll go to these figures. And then we'll probably do a couple giveaways. We'll talk about a few things. And we'll play some games. So again, welcome, everybody. Happy Tuesday night to you. Thank you, everybody, for joining taking part in this live stream with me. I super appreciate it. So... Let's dive into the first bag, guys. Again, if you're new, this is a couple of the possibilities. I think it says, yeah, so it says that there's eight different ones in this. And for this one, it says that there's 16 different Power Rangers in this one. Excuse me, pick up. All right, so let's see what we get in this one, guys. Let's dive in. So you can't really feel anything because it's got the cardboard in it, much like the um, much like the mystery minis do, to where you can't really feel it. So we've got... Wait, oh my gosh, these are wild. So we got the Heartbreak Kid Shawn Michaels. Look at the face on these things, guys. This guy, it literally has like, I don't know if you can see. It's literally got Shawn Michaels' face on it. So it's literally like wall wall walkers. And he's got like a little like, whatever this material is, like the sticky material, that's like the midsection of the body. That's so funny. Okay, so yeah, so we got HBK, the Heartbreak Kid Shawn Michaels. So that's the first one we've got. Let's check the second bag, guys. What are your predictions? Who do you think we're getting? I hope we get like a Ric Flair and Austin. Awesome. That would be cool. Maybe Ultimate Warrior. So we got Sting, Kurt Angle, um, Roddy Piper, Bret Hart, Macho Man. Let's see what we get in this one, guys. So again, these were a buck. I would say check your local dollar store. My local dollar store is like a dollar tree. So did we get a different one? Oh, we did get a different one. Okay, guys. So we got... The Hitman, Bret Hart. Got the Hitman, Bret Hart. Look, like, look, this. that's just the, that's what sold me on these. Not only the fact that it was a mystery, but I'm just a sexy boy. Jerry, I got to tell you, man, your intro and the Nerd Bar, your intro, man, that warmed my heart that you guys played along with that. And you do an excellent Razor Ramon and the Nerd Bar, excellent Hulk Hogan. So thank you guys so much for playing along. So just the faces on these things, aside from the fact that they're mystery, is what sold me, like, it's like it's literally just like a, a mini picture of them stuck to like 
just a piece of plastic. I just think that that's so funny. So just for the lulls, I had to get that. So two unbaggings out of the way. You know what we do is stuff we don't need anymore, guys. <laughs> Kobe! Thankfully, I have a trash bag or a trash box over here. So let's dive into these Power Ranger ones. I'm interested. So it says that there's 16 different... Yeah, so I would say check your local Dollar Trees or Dollar Store. Let's see what you get. So yeah, these are these are pretty big and bulky. So I can't really feel too much inside. This one feels like it has like some sort of sword or blade to it. This one I can't really tell. So let's just dive in. Hey Fox Crown, Sarah Aldris, thank you again so much for joining. I really hope that you feel better. I know that you aren't feeling well, but I so appreciate your time. DJ Funko Hunter. All right, let's see what we get, guys. Ready? Let me show you first. What do we get? Hey, we got Tommy Oliver, baby. Yeah. Tommy Oliver with the flute sword. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, Sarah, I was hoping for a pink ranger too. Come on, crush. All right, so we got that. These are pretty, I mean, these are pretty decent size for, for a book. So that's pretty awesome. So we got that. We'll put that in the background. So we got Tommy Oliver, the green ranger in the first bag. Jason David Frank. So... Predictions, guys. What do you think is going to be in this one? It doesn't, um, unlike the wrestling one, it doesn't show possibilities of what's going to be in the back or inside. It's going to, it just shows like, so 16 to collect. Um, so again, Hasbro is the one that makes these. So let's see what we get inside, guys. The best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be. And I know now, Jerry, that you don't mess with the bad guy. You beat me fair and square, man. I'm a man of my word. So the belt is coming your way. And then whatever challenge you decide to issue, I'm... Oh, uh-oh. Whatever it was, it broke. I think this is a Lord Zed, because I think that's, like, part of Lord Zed's um, staff. No, nope. what the hell is this? Oh, oh, you assemble it. Oh, okay, so it's a Zord. Hold on. Hold on. Do these... I don't know if these are going to go in. It's one of the oh, crikey. Okay, so it's one of the one of the Zords. It's like a not a pterodactyl, but it's. So I thought it had broken, but the wings, um, yeah, the wings are, are. I mean, it's it's a buck, so the wings don't really go in very well. But I guess I thought it was a blade that I was feeling. So that's what we got. So we got a little uh little Zord. So cool. All right. So all right with that. So, again, thank you guys so much. If you didn't tell from the title, hey, Funko fam. So, we're going to help some people out tonight. So, first and foremost, I want to help some people that are actually in this room right now with their subscribers. I want to help out Boondock Pops, and I want to help out Brian over at Pop and Sun Pops. They are so close. They are less than 10 away from 500, um, I think. Uh, wait, Boondock, I think, is a few away from 400, I believe. And then um, and then uh, Brian is a few away from 500, if I'm not mistaken. So if we can help them out, guys, I know that the most of the room, most of the community is already following them. But if you aren't, please make sure that you're following them. Please, 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 with sugar on top. I would so appreciate that because they are literally so close. They are just teetering on the edge of their milestone so i know we can do it so let's see if we can't make that happen for them guys um so again i know the muslim community already is but if you aren't already go follow aiden and brian and the giggling ghosts over at pop and some pops and make sure to support jerry over at boondock pops two awesome amazing i'm sure that the majority of the people in here tonight already are but if you're new to a stream if you're new to a live if you aren't already please make sure to go follow them like i said i'm pretty sure that i think jerry is like seven or eight away and then same thing with pop and sons they're about seven or eight away from their next milestone so up 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 let's see if we can do it very cool awesome brian happy to do it of course um happy 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 i sound like uncle Sai. happy 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 to do it guys for sure so just again thank you guys so much for being a part of this live stream so that's what i wanted to start off with first and foremost um actually the first person that we're going to shut out just came in the room so Here's what we're going to do. This person has no idea that I'm about to shout them. And this person has 18 subs right now on YouTube. However, they are super active on my lives. They always pop into all of my lives. They are super supportive on my Instagram. So I am going to 
post right now a link that I want you guys to go to. So the channel is for my boy, Supreme Carnage. So here's what's going to happen. Here's the link right there. Hold on. Let me see if I can pin it. Mods, if you could pin that in the chat. Super appreciated. I need I need the beard. I just shaved. I just shaved and I got a haircut. I got a haircut today and the girl at the haircutting place was like, are you crazy? It's 20 degrees outside. Why do you want a haircut? I said, I'm all about low maintenance, baby. The least I have to do, the better. So, so yeah. So mods, if we could pin that, I would sure appreciate it. So yeah, so Supreme Carnage. He's at 18 subscribers right now. Um, please go to his channel. Um, actually, hold on. Let me link. Let me link a video that we can comment, and we'll do a giveaway. So here's what we're gonna do. So that that was the link to his page. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna link a video. All right. So we're gonna link a video. We're gonna give it some time, and then we'll do our very first of five giveaways tonight. So. This is the video that I want you guys to go to. So go to the video, just put comment or hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. So um, one of the, I think the first one I put was for his page. The second one is for the video. Go to the video, hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. I'll give that about five, 10 minutes and then I'll tell you guys what, um, here, I'll put it again. Mike. Vintage sent me. So that's his channel. That's the video. That's the hashtag. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. So we'll give that about five, 10 minutes. And actually, while we're doing that, I can tell you guys what the very first prize is. So the very first prize is a free entry into my raffle for a mystery box tonight. We'll get to that a little bit later. Want to start off with a bang. Want to give him some support. He had about 18 subscribers, so I know that we can... I'm not looking for like a certain number. Just if you go, just make sure you subscribe to him. Hopefully you like what you see. And comment, hashtag Mikey Vintage on the video. And in a few minutes, we'll do a random comment picker. We'll pull, and that person will get a free entry into my Damage Mystery Box raffle. We'll talk about that a little bit later. So, Supreme Carnage is the channel. I've linked the video. Thank you so much, Mods, for helping me out. So... Let me go ahead and unshow that. Thank you, everybody, so much for taking part. Like I said, he's fairly new to the Funko Pop community, but he is always he's a, he's been in every single one of my lives since I started. He is always super supportive on Instagram for me. Wow, damn, you guys work fast. He's already at thirty five subscribers. You guys are insane, insane in the membrane, insane in the brain. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate that. Wow, you guys are incredible. Incredible. So, Supreme Carnage, hope you enjoy the love and support that is heading your way, my friend. So, like I said, I need to get a piece of paper. That way I can mark all the giveaway winners. So, once we pull that name, I'll be sure to write it on here. That way I know. So, like I said, guys, hopefully you're not tired because we have five giveaways tonight. That's just number one of five. Oh, by the way, I'm fine. I, I was at work yesterday at, well, I should specify, I was at Applebee's yesterday and I cut my thumb on the lemon slicer. I went to go pull a piece of lemon out because it was stuck. And yeah, I got... I'm okay though. Wah, wah, wah. So again, hopefully everyone's having a good night. Thank you so much. Um, yep. Thank you, uh, Mama J. Thank you, Brian, for posting up. Let me make sure, Brian, did I make you a mod? If I didn't, I need to make you a mod. I'll make you a mod right now. Okay, you are a mod. Okay, good. Cool, cool. Cool, cool. Thank you guys so very much. Like I said, we'll give that in a couple of minutes and we'll do... A random hashtag. So, while we're hanging out, everyone, uh, who has Disney Plus? What are you watching on Disney Plus? I would love to know. Uh, your boy, obviously, Mighty Ducks, duh. A goofy movie, Powerline, duh. So, what are you guys watching on Disney Plus, guys? Let me know. I'd love to hear it. You are the goddess of lollipops. That is the name that uh, the giggling ghosts and Aiden have christened you with. So, yeah. I th honestly, like, I think that they're so excited because anytime they see a box from you, they know they're going to get candy. So I think that that's awesome. How's the Hot Topic gig? It's good. It's good. It's been a little bit of a slow start because, like, I'm still in, like, the training phase. But next week, I'm pretty much being thrown into it full force because it is Black Friday and it's crunch time. It's the busiest. So Black Friday, Cyber Saturday, and something Monday. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday is, like... It's going to be on and popping. So that's why I want to get... I want to crank out a couple of videos this week. I wanted to do this live stream because... 
come the weekend. I know you guys are probably going to be busy. I'm probably going to be busy. I probably won't be able to make any content. I do have a couple other videos filmed. I have like one or two other videos filmed. So those will be up at some point between, you know, this stream. I plan to do a video tomorrow. We'll get to that. But um, so I have at least two or three videos planned before uh, the weekend. So we'll see how that goes. But it's good. Hot Topic is going good. Uh, like I said, slow start. But next week, I'm just going to be whoo, throwing into the fire full force. Um, Simpsons. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Like I said, what are you guys watching on, uh, on Disney plus? Hey tats 79. How's it going? My friend. Um, yeah. What do you guys watch on Disney plus? So yeah. Uh, what are you guys planning on doing for black Friday? What are your plans for the holidays? Anyone doing any shopping? Anyone going to hot topic? Anyone going to employee discount Monday? Yeah. No. When I first started, they said, you know, just so you know, we have everyone on staff working. Um, I'm pretty sure I go in at like 5 a.m. So be kind to your retail associates. Please be patient with them. Be patient with people like myself. We're really trying. We're there for you guys. So yeah, I think I go in at like 5 or 6 a.m. to Hot Topic. Um, and then I actually work at night to help, you know, all those people that were shopping for, um, you know, Black Friday and stuff. Getting them their food and beverages and alcohol needs. Gargoyles. Nice. Yes. Awesome. Batman Pops are gargoyles. Definitely a uh, hidden gem for sure. I remember it. I didn't watch it a whole lot when it was on Disney. I watched what I watched. I watched Goof Troop, DuckTales, Tailspin, Rescue Rangers, Darkwing Duck. Um, yeah, for sure. Yeah, so definitely be kind to your retail associates. Um, so yeah, so what are you watching on Disney Plus? Um, what are your plans for Black Friday? Are you planning on doing any shopping? I know a lot of people are um, going to do like cyber shopping, obviously like Amazon, um, the Funko Hunter and Gilbert were telling me about some awesome mystery boxes that are going to be coming out. I know GameStop's got a few, I think they're doing like Adam at Beard of Pop said that the Rick and Morty, um, GameStop is doing like a Rick and Morty box. And I think they're doing like a Marvel box as well, along with these DC boxes that just recently dropped. So, um, did anyone get any chases out of those Disney boxes? I know those have been like fairly popular videos within the community this week. So, all right, while you guys are commenting, I'm going to pull up the uh, random comment picker. Let's see where... Again, thank you guys so much for supporting my friend Supreme Carnage. Um, I really enjoy his videos. He does a lot of raffles and stuff on Instagram too. So, wow, 40 subscribers. You guys are whew, incredible. Appreciate you guys very much. So, like I said, that's one of four giveaways. So, we're going to get ready to lock that down fairly soon. Pull a winner from that. So, like I said, so... Um, stay at home on Black Friday. Yeah, I know a lot of people are either going out, they're not doing anything, or they're just doing like cyber shopping. So, just curious what everyone's doing. Random comment picker YouTube. All right, guys, it's we'll give it we'll give it another minute. We'll give it another minute, and then we'll pull a winner. I will show you guys on my phone. Thank you guys so much again for being in my live stream, for supporting. Um, I'm a Sean the correct way. Nice, Batman Joker Chase. Yeah, hopefully everyone's having a good night. I'm going to pull up this video real quickly. Supreme Carnage. Yeah, thank you guys so much. You guys are like fast. That was, I was. Like I said, I didn't really have like a set um, goal subscriber wise in mind. I just wanted to give him some support. Cyber shopping, yeah. Stay at home Black Friday. Like I said, I'm working. I don't plan on doing any shopping. Um, oh, apparently there's two different Supreme Carnages. I did not know that. One had like a pretty, uh, pretty like metal font. I'm like, that's not the one I'm looking for. All right, Tony the Tiger. All right, guys. So. Let's get ready. So again, this will be for a free entry into my mystery box raffle. Um, I'll have more details about that later on. All right, let's get the, can you guys see? Okay, hold on, let me hold a little bit closer. So let's get the link, copy link. All right, let's go to the random comment picker. All right, guys, good luck to everybody. Thank you so much for everyone that has subscribed. Um, yeah, really. Yeah. Well, that's what, that's, I, I'm a huge wrestling fan and that's what led me to do like the, the snow cold Mikey Vintage in the fresh fish was the fact that I'm, you know, a bald SOB. So now, you know, all right, good luck to everybody. Here we go. So this is for an entry into let's filter duplicate users. All right. So we got 23 unique comments guys. Here we go. 
when you see, I will see. So for a free entry into the mystery box raffle, let's see. Uh oh. Uh oh. Nope. Sorry, we got to pick another one. I think that was something completely different. All right, here we go. 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 It's gotta have the hashtag, guys. Hey, Amanda Sparkle. Congratulations, Amanda Sparkle. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. I will watch in the future. Awesome. All right. Congratulations, Amanda Sparkle. I am marking that down right now. You have a free entry into my damage mystery box happening later on Amanda Sparkle. Does anyone call you Robin Sparkles? Do you get that often? Let's go to the mall today. How I Met Your Mother fans. You'll get that reference. All right. So, Amanda Sparkle. Congratulations. Aw, let's show that up there. Congratulations, Amanda. You're very welcome. Thank you for taking part and supporting my Funko friend. So, plenty more giveaways to come, guys. Um, you know what? Let's do another one. You guys want to do another one? You guys want to do another giveaway? Let's do giveaway number two. What do you think? If five people say yes, we'll do it. You want to do another giveaway right now? Let me know. And we'll talk about a few things. Yeah, congratulations again, Amanda. So, all right, so we shot at Supreme Carnage, so, all right, so, for this one, it's going to be a little bit different, so, this one that we are shouting out is actually not a YouTube, and it's not even Funko Pop related, okay, so, this is the person that inspired me to start making YouTube videos, guys, this is the person that inspired me. Just her journey and her kind heart and just being an amazing person. She has been a friend of mine for years now on social media. Never met her in person, but she is just such a kind heart, amazing soul. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to link up her Instagram. And all I want you guys to do, there's no hashtags, no tomfoolery, no trickery. I just want you guys to go subscribe to her. Just follow her. So just give her a follow on Instagram. She has no idea I'm doing this, by the way. But this is the young lady. Her name is Delaney. She is the one that inspired me to start making YouTube videos. And she has been on a hell of a journey and just came out better on the other side. So, linked down below. This is the Instagram I want you guys to go to. Send her a sub. Check out her content. Again, it's not even Funko Pop related. Just, she is all about spreading positive vibes and just a super awesome friend and i really want to do this for her because she is the reason why i am here today she is the reason why you guys get to see my channel and you have been allowed into my life because she allowed me into her life and just showed her world and what she's been through and so you know as most of you know i was bullied a lot in my life and she is she's gone through a lot she really has gone through a lot and she she's just an amazing person kind-hearted to help me out a lot when I was starting out on um, on YouTube. And she has fur babies. She has fur babies looks much like me. She has a Russell Jack Terrier named Sammy. And she has, I'm not, I think it might be, a, I can't think of the breed of dog. She's going to kill me for not knowing that. I think it might be another kind of terrier. But her, she has another dog named Colby. So she posts a lot of her fur babies, much like I do. Hopefully if you guys saw my story, you saw my feed prior to the live. You saw Athena just being a ham. Her running between my legs and her wanting to get into the shot, trying to crawl out of the baby gate to get into focus. So, um, so just thank you guys sincerely so very much. Uh, I just want to give back to her. It's something I've never done. Is shout. I mean, I've shouted people's Instagram and YouTube, but this is like I said, non funker related. I just want to send a lot of love and care and support system her way. I know, I know that she does, but she she hasn't really made youtube videos in a while so i would i think i'm just going to send you guys to her instagram and if she decides to make youtube videos again she can promote that um i do i i would shout both but i don't know if she plans on making youtube videos again so i'm just going to send you to her instagram and that way if she does start making videos you'll know firsthand from her there so but yeah she's awesome delaney is super awesome um just a super kind hearted person in the community um super down to earth super awesome so, um, I just, I really, 
appreciate her very much. So just thank you guys so much for going and checking her out. Um, so I guess, I guess this is what we can do because I just realized now that I'm not going to be able to pull a comment from her Instagram. So I'm just going to link up her last YouTube video that she posted. Um, I'll give you guys a quick hashtag and we'll pull from there. Um, you don't have to subscribe to her on Instagram or excuse me. You don't have to subscribe to her on YouTube. If you don't want, if you want to just leave a quick comment, that's fine. Just so I can pull a name. Cause I was only planning on shouting her Instagram, but I just realized now I'm not going to be able to pull a comment from her subs on Instagram. Cause I'm not able to see that information. So, um, so I'm just going to link up her most recent video. I'll give it like five minutes. And so while I'm doing that, I can tell you guys what this prize is. So this is something that I've never offered before but it's something that I thought would be very cool. So here's what we're offering for this prize, guys. The person that I pull from this video, your name will be linked. Your name and your Instagram or your YouTube will be linked at the very top of my Funko friends list for every single video for the rest of November and for the entire month of December. You will be listed in my Funko friends so people will have quick access to your account. So this is a link right here to her most recent YouTube video. Go to that. Just comment, you know, Mikey Vintage says hi. That's it. Yeah. Hashtag Mikey Vintage says hi. Okay. So we'll give that about five minutes. And like I said, the person that I draw will be at the top of my Funko friends list for every single video in the description bar for every video in November and for every video for the entire month of December. So Mikey Vintage says hi. That's the hashtag. Um, so thank you guys so very much. Like I said, we'll give that about five minutes and then I'll pull a, uh, just a random comment from there. And that person will get guaranteed for the rest of November, the rest of December, very top of my Funko list for everybody to check out. Hey, South GA Phoenix. Welcome. 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 All right. So thank you guys so much for already showing her support on Instagram. I just felt like this was the, I didn't think, I didn't think this through, uh, I wasn't planning on linking her YouTube. You know, like I said, you don't have to subscribe to her if you don't want to. If you would like to, I'm sure she would appreciate it. I would appreciate it. Not a necessary requirement. Um, so we'll give that about five minutes and we will pull a comment from there. Like I said, just a super amazing, incredible friend. Um, super bright, shining ray of light in my life. And so I, I just want to send some amazing people like you guys her way. She's super dope and just been such a stellar friend. So she has, again, she has no idea that I'm even doing this. So, so thank you guys so much. I'm just going to go pull just the, the link to her video. I'm not going to run the comments just yet. Thank you guys so much. Hopefully again, everyone's having a good night. Thank you, Mama J for linking that out. Very much appreciate that. Just quick. Mikey Vinches says, hi, you don't have to sub to her if you don't want to. Um, Copying the link real quick. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Thank you for those that did subscribe to her. She she just gained like five more subscribers since I shot her. It wasn't like I said, it wasn't a planned thing. Wasn't a necessary requirement. Like I said, do it for the puppers. Do it for the fur babies. She's got beautiful fur babies, and she posts about them all the time on her social media, much like I post about Athena. All right, so we've got the link pasted. I won't run that just yet. We'll give that another. We'll give it another minute and 30 seconds. So thank you guys so much, everybody. Much appreciated. So again, the winner for this, they will get linked up in the description bar of every single one of my videos for the remainder of November and into December as, you know, one of my amazing Funko friends. So it's just a click. It's got, it'll have your name. It'll have a quick link for someone to click and they'll be right there on your page. So I want to give back to you guys. Thought that that would be a super cool, super dope prize. So this will be prize number two of five for tonight. Like I said, all the people that we're shouting out tonight have absolutely no idea that we're even doing this. So I thought that would be a super fun way to just give back, get the community involved. So I just want to send some positive vibes and some amazing friends her way. Like you guys are friends in mine. Um, I hope so too. That's what I'm really hoping. I'm hoping that by sending her 
And it's not a matter of she doesn't want to do it. I understand that life gets busy. She she has a job too, so I understand that life gets busy. So I really hope that this kind of encourages her and motivates her, inspires her, because that's what happened with her to me. She was doing these YouTube videos, and I said, man, I really want to start YouTube, but I don't know where to get started. I don't know what to do. So she was telling me about like editing techniques. She was telling me like what motivates her. You know, she's like, I film and I edit when I'm motivated to. If you don't film or edit, if you're just kind of phoning it in. People are going to know. People are going to know. So she really inspired and encouraged me. So I really hope, like you said, Fox, when I really hope that this does inspire her to, you know, do more. I agree with you. So just want to send some positive vibes and some amazing friends her way. So I really hope that that's the case, that that is exactly what happens. So, all right, we'll give it about another 45 seconds and we'll pull a winner. I'm just, I'm plugging, I'm plugging the... Link in right now, but I won't run it until like another 40 seconds. Oh, where did it go? Did I close out of it? I closed out of it. I sure did. All right. Thank you so much, everybody, for your kindness and hospitality and support. Thank you. I'm glad that you guys think so. It's something that I've been wanting to do for a while. I'm like, man, that'd be such a cool prize. So yeah, so this person will be linked up. So expect more traffic your way for the next month or so because it's just a quick, easy way for people to get to your channel, you know? And of course I'm happy. So it, it helps out multiple people. It helps out Delaney, more people coming her way. It helps out the winner because then it's, you know, if someone's reading my description, they're the very first name. So it's a fast track to their page. Hey, he likes this page. So let's check them out. All right, guys. So we got about another, okay, let's pull a winner. What do you say? All right. So we're just plugging in her video right here. Oh, what I do? I hate when I click on, no, I don't want to go to an ad. No, no, don't you dare take me to an ad. I don't want to. All right. Awesome. So we got 18 unique comments, guys. Super incredible. Hey, everyone. Hey, Fritzy Funko. Hey, South GA Phoenix. All right, guys. Ready? So 18 unique comments. Oh, go away, you stupid ad. No! Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. That was a little intense. All right. Here we go, guys. Once you see, I will see. So this is for DJ Pop Funko Hunter. Awesome. Mikey Vitch just sent me cool videos. So congratulations. Congrats, congrats, congrats. I'm making a note of that right now. So you will now be included in my Funko Friends list for the entire month of December and the rest of November. Your link and your name will be right there in my description bar at the top of the list. Congratulations. DJ Funko Hunter. All right, just making a note of that. All right, guys, so awesome. Two giveaways in the bag. We're only 40 minutes into the stream. So just thank you guys so much. Again, if you're new to the stream, I want to know down below, what have you been watching on Disney Plus? Let me know also, what was the last Funko Pop that you guys picked up? I would love to know. All right, let's close out of this real quick. Thank you guys so much again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, everyone, for um DJ Funko Pop on. You're still in here. Okay, there you are. Okay, awesome. Very cool, my friend. Congratulations. Thank you so much, everybody, for show. I just felt like this was such a cool thing because it showcases DJ Funko Hunter now to a wider audience. Now Delaney gets to be seen on a wider audience on Instagram and also on YouTube. Just thank you guys so much that's what it's all about whenever i do a giveaway whenever i do a stream i always want to give back to you guys with promotion and giveaways and you guys always help me out so i just very very much appreciate you guys and your time and your hospitality and just thank you everyone and again i really do hope that in doing this this motivates her to you know come back to youtube make more videos um very much appreciate that so Congratulations again, DJ Funk Hunter, and congratulations again, Amanda Sparkle. Congrats to you guys. You guys are two winners. We've got three more giveaways left. So let's see. What else can we do? Oh, Brian, popping some pops. He's still in here? Brian, I got to show you something if you're in here. Mama J, you'll appreciate this too. Ooh, the Diamond Collection Flounder. Awesome. Gargoyles, Darkwing Duck, Tailspin, Live Action Lady in the Champ. Awesome, South J. Phoenix. The MTV Moon Person. Awesome. Oh, that reminds me. Speaking of MTV Moon Person, we got to talk about two Funko Pop controversies that you may or may not have heard of. So, um, with the MTV Moon Person, I think it's interesting how 
Funko has titled it that. That way it's gender neutral. That way no one can say, well, it says man. Now, obviously, those of us like myself that grew up with MTV, it was called the MTV Moon Man. I get it. I understand why they're doing it. So it's no problem to me. But I guess some people are. I feel like it's so that Funko doesn't have a ride on their hand. It's general. It's gender neutral. I think it looks super dope. It's a very heavy pop. That is a very heavy pop. And I also picked up the, I can't think of his name, but the rock character that's going to be in the upcoming um, Frozen movie. Gilbert over at Dancer TV was talking about it. And I saw, excuse me, I saw it in my local Walmart and I picked them up. And yeah, that, that rock pop is a heavy pop. I don't know if they purposely, I feel like they purposely made it feel like a rock. Um, and then same thing with that uh, MTV Moon person. That also is a funk, uh, a heavy Funko Pop for sure. So I picked them both up and I like compared. And also speaking of Walmart, I don't know if you guys knew this, but here's a little fun fact. The MTV Moon person was actually originally supposed to be a Walmart exclusive. I watched Dom over at Box Attack. He did a video on it. And behind the MTV Classic Icon sticker, there is a Walmart sticker on the box. So if you have that, check it out. I wouldn't recommend ripping the sticker off, but there's a there's a exclusive to Walmart sticker behind the icon sticker, the MTV icon sticker. So I found that out from Dom. So thank you, Dom from BoxTech, for the information. I want to pass that along to you guys. Yeah, again, I don't mind either way. It doesn't bother me, but some people, I guess, are phased by it. Oh, it's MTV Moon Man. I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. I get why they did it so that Funko didn't have a ride on their hands and so there wasn't any controversy. People saying da-da-da-da. So... Speaking of a controversy that is happening currently, I don't know if you guys are aware, but speaking of Frozen, a lot of parents are upset by the mold of the Olaf pop. I don't know if you've seen it, but let's see if I can pull a picture up of it. People, parents are upset because their their children aren't understanding why the parents aren't wanting to buy this Funko Pop for them. But apparently, the Funko Pop Olaf has his hands close to his crotch, his general region. So, yeah, so let me see if I can pull up a picture of that real quick to show you guys. So, again, it's one of those things I don't mind. I don't care either way. I'm a sick puppy like that, so I found it funny. So I'm going to pull a picture of that up real quickly. So it's not a Walmart exclusive or anything. It's just the uh, it's just the Olaf pop that came out from Frozen 2. I'm going to find a picture of it so I can show you guys. But parents are in an uproar. Kids are upset. Yeah, Earth Giant. That's what it's called. I couldn't think of its last name. Olaf Funko Pop Frozen 2. Sorry, you guys probably didn't need the narration of me typing into Google. All right, Olaf Funko Pop. So like I said, parents are in an uproar. Kids are upset because their parents won't buy it from them. They don't understand why. So I guess a lot of parents are like, why was this the mold that was given? I found it funny. When I saw it in the stores, man, I thought it was funny. All right, so let me pull color back up on my phone. You guys have got to see this. If you haven't already, all right, guys, check this out. So this is the Olaf pop. This is what the parents are upset about because of the hand placement of this Olaf. I thought it was funny as all hell. Yeah, he's holding his little giblets. He's holding his little snowballs. So I guess the community is in an uproar because of the placement of the hands. Do I think that they did it purposely? No, I feel like he's probably just holding on to one of his buttons or I feel like like whenever he not like lovey dovey, but whenever he's like kind of like schmoozing, whenever like on or else are talking to him, I feel like that's what he does is he puts his hands, you know, he doesn't really not necessarily to his side, but I, I, I think it's funny. I don't think it was an intentional thing. Obviously, I think he's just trying to cover one of his buttons, but you know. Parents in an uproar because of the placement of the twigs of the sticks. He's holding on to his little snowballs, but what are you going to do? I feel like this is exactly what they were trying to avoid with the MTV moon person. It's something like this. Why does it say moon man? Why isn't it moon person or moon woman? Like, calm down. It's all good. So just wanted to share that since we're on the conversation of controversy stuff that was pretty funny had to share that so like i said yeah that earth giant and that uh, mtv moon person are definitely heavy heavy pops so all right so yeah agreed i 
it's just hands. It's not like they gave him a freaking corn cob or something. You know what I mean? Like, come on. So, yeah. Uh, it's just one of those things, man. People are going to be upset no matter what you do. I just thought it was funny. I had seen the pop, and then I heard about the controversy, and I was like, ha! It's kind of funny. So, yeah. It's just... it's. I don't think that it was done intentionally. Clearly, Funko pumps out a lot of money to create these pops, so I think that they knew what they were doing. I don't think it was like an accidental thing. Oh my gosh, yeah. That's funny. But yeah, so I wanted to share it with you guys. I thought that was interesting. Wanted to wanted to share with you guys. Thought it would be super fun. Um, <laughs> oh my god, Fox Crown. Silly. Yeah, agreed, Amanda. They do need to chill out. It's just a cartoon. It's just an animation. It's not that serious, people. But what are you going to do? Anyway, so again, congratulations again to DJ Funko Hunter. Congratulations again to Amanda Sparkle. Two of my first winners of the giveaways. We've got three more going on, guys. Um. The nerd bar, what I was talking about is that parents are in an uproar over the new Olaf pop because of the placement of his hands. Apparently, parents are saying that his hands are in the placement of covering his snowballs, but I'll leave it up to you guys to decide. So, hold on, guys. I'll be right back. One of my kitchen lights is, like, wigging out. I don't want it to blow out. I'll be right back. Hold on. Ha ah, Nickelodeon! Okay, guys, sorry about that. Sorry about the dead air. Um, so thank you guys. Thank you to Pops the Purpose, Boondock Pops, Dancer TV. Thank you guys for sending me stickers to put up on my sticker wall. If anybody has stickers and wants to send them to me, I will gladly display them. I would love to. So just epic, amazing people in the community. Once again, if you're new to the stream, if you aren't already, please make sure that you're going to support and follow Jerry over at Boondock Pops. And please make sure that you're going over to Brian and Aiden to support Pop and Some Pops. So I don't know if Brian is still in here, but I want to show this off. Mama J, you'll appreciate this. So in today's video, Mama J sent a care package over to them. And I thought the kiss with Scooby-Doo was such an awesome thing. I did not realize that that was even a thing. So I found this and I'm planning on sending this to Aiden for Christmas. So it's literally a panda bear with kiss makeup. So I'm going to send that to Brian and Aiden. So Brian, if you're still here, that's coming to, that's coming the way of the little guy. So had to show that off. found that in the wild today. It reminded me of mama Jay's uh, contribution. So wanted to uh, show that off. So Yes, I would love a sticker. So what do you think of that, Mama J? Isn't that super cool? Yeah, Mama J. I didn't even realize that was a thing. That It was like Kiss Meets Scooby-Doo. That was so dope. That was so funny. Um, Jeremy, welcome. Um, welcome, everybody. If uh, you're new to the live and I didn't get a chance to say hi to you, welcome, welcome. Thank you guys so much for putting me on the road to 350 subscribers. We're about like 20 or 30 away, which is insane. Like I've said in every one of my streams, I started this channel in late june early july just as a fun little hobby wanted to showcase my pops little did i know that a few months on the road we would be here i am thankful for every single person that reached out to me on social media i am thankful for every single person that takes time out of their day to watch my videos to comment to just be the amazing funko pop community i very much appreciate that so thank you guys for helping me and putting me on the road to 350 subscribers i am just blown away by that so, of course, you know, wanted to do some giveaways. Wanted to say thank you guys. Trying to, like, adjust my hat. I'm, like, trying to do it in the webcam, and it's not really working. Okay. Sorry. Bald is beautiful. Okay. So, um, so yeah. So, I just want to do a couple, you know, extra, extra crispy, extra zesty giveaways towards the community, towards you guys. So, just thank you guys so much. We will do a proper giveaway 
when I do actually reach 350 subscribers. So you know me, I'm all about giveaway epic extravaganza. So just wanted to, you know, do a couple things in the live stream to kind of get you guys hyped up and get you excited. So once we do actually hit 350 subscribers, there will be a prize. I'm still working out the details. I'm trying to do something different. I'm trying to do something that no one's ever done before. That's what I always like to do is just do different things. Um, thank you very much, DJ Pop Hunter. I very much appreciate that. DJ Funko Pop Hunter, I very much appreciate that. Um, just super awesome community, man. Like I said, when I first started this, I had no idea. It was just a fun little side hobby. This is my escape, you guys. And I'm sure you can probably relate with me. Working in retail, it takes a special kind of crazy. Working with the general public takes a special kind of crazy. This is like my chill out time. This is like my chill out zone. Doing live streams, filming videos, editing videos, watching other people. So I had no idea that when I hit 50 subscribers, I was blown away. When I hit 100, I was blown away. 150, I was blown away. Like, so I'm just very thankful for every single one of you. The fact that 300 plus people take the time out of their day to subscribe to me, to watch my videos, to comment on my videos, to be in my live stream, to see me on social media. Just thank you guys so much. I do sincerely appreciate it. I had no idea, like I said, when I first started, this was just a fun hobby for me. And you guys have made it just so much more than that. And I just cannot thank you enough. I really appreciate that. Um, so just real quickly, I wanted to say thank you. So I know a lot of people are getting anxious for the mystery box. So we're not going to do it quite yet, but I'm going to show you another pop. So in my video today, if you guys didn't see, this is the first damage pop that's going to be in the mystery box. I'm trying to see if I can get a good angle, if you guys can see it. Can you see that black? There you, there we go. Can you see it? That black mark on the window. So that's a black paint on the window. Um, other than that, there's no, like, dents or dings. The bottom kind of does come out a little bit, but um, I think it's just because of the weight of the pop. I know a lot of pops do that. So this is the first pop that's being showcased. So this is one that you can look forward to in your box. So I'm going to show another one. I'm probably going to show two, possibly three from this box tonight. And what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to pull a winner in tomorrow's video. So if you aren't already aware, I am doing a Funko Pop raffle for this box. Amanda already has an entry. Uh, Mama J reached out to me prior to the live, and she is also part of this raffle as well. So if you would like to partake, DM me on Instagram. It's only $3. $3, that's it, for an entry into this mystery box, and I will, I will pick a winner in tomorrow's video. So the box is valued at over $50. I double-checked the PPG this morning to double-check and make sure that nothing had gone down, so everything is still $50 plus. So essentially for a $3 entry, you have potential to win – a $50 plus dollar mystery box. So I'm going to show you another pop that is in the box right now. So we have Tiffany from Bride of Chucky. I unboxed this recently. However, after further inspection, there's a little crinklage down here in the middle of the box. Let's see. Where did it go? That's a different box. There's a different box that has something to it. So on this side, you guys, you can see right here on the lip, it's from like being opened quite a bit. So, um, other than that, like I said, a lot these pops don't have like significant damage. It's like minor damage. The bottom, can you see the bottom of this? So it's essentially the bottom, the corner right here. Um, and just like the lip, that's pretty much all that has damage on these. So these are two of the six pops that will be in the box. I'm still trying to decide if I'm going to show one, only one more or two more. I don't want to show everything because I want it to be a genuine mystery. If someone knows exactly what they're going to get, like there's no purpose in it. So I want to make sure. So I think I might do, what do you guys think? Do you want to see one more and keep the other three a mystery or should I show two more? Just comment one or two. Let me know. Cause I want to show you guys, but I also don't want to like completely take the mystery away. So right now we're at two. So if I show one more, Hey, Michael and Faith, welcome back. So if I show one more, I feel like that'd be fair, but do you guys want to see? So just comment on this video right now, one or two. Do you want to see one more pop from the box? Or do you want to see two more from the box? Like I said, there is no significant, significant box damage. Um, it's it's mostly box damage. None of these are out of the box. You're not going to have an 11 that's trying to escape like my Galactic Toys Mystery Box. They're all pretty pristine. Okay, Boondogs doesn't want to see any. South GA Phoenix says too. I don't want to show everything because then it's not a mystery box anymore. I, I don't want to do that because then it's not a mystery. Then you know everything that you're getting. That's not a mystery. So, all right, guys. So one more or two more. The Nerd Bar, thank you so much. 
thank you so much for popping in. I very much appreciate that so much. DJ Funko Pop Hunter. Yes, I use a letter opener too to get in my box. For a long time, I was using scissors, and it was making people a little anxious and uneasy. So I have a letter opener now. Ava Rooster, ka -ka! welcome. All right. So here's what I'll do. I'll show one more, and then a little bit, a little little bit of time go by. I'll explain the boxes, and then when I get to the end of explaining this box, we'll decide if we want to do another one. So bye, nerd bar. Thank you so much for joining. All right. So I will show one more that's in the box, guys. All right. So we have. The Daggett from Angry Beavers. So the box damage on this one is right here on top. You can see see in the corner there's like a little scrapage. And then right here on this side of the box, it's a little bit dented in. But like I said, no like major significant damage. A couple scratches on the window. So as of right now, this is half of the box right here. This is half of the box that you will receive. They'll all be in box. None of these are going to be out of box. So these are three of the six pops. So, again, reach out to me on Instagram. Just DM me. It's $3. $3 for an entry into this box. The box itself, like I said, I double-checked PPG this morning to make sure that no values have gone down. It is $50 plus. That is a guarantee. So this is half the box right here. So just DM me on Instagram. These pops could be yours. I will pull a winner. There's no limit. There's no cap to the amount of times that you could enter. So if you want to do, you want to have more than one entry, it's just three dollars per entry. So, just I really want to give back, um, and I want this to go to a good home. Um, so those are three of the pops. So there's still three that have not been seen yet. So I'm gonna let a little time go by. We'll go back to that. And then we'll discuss. So those. So one more time. These are three of the six pops that are going to be in the box. We got Tiffany, we got Daggett, and we got the Rory with Predator. This is a Funko Shop exclusive. I can show you guys a little bit closer since now I have the good camera. And again, this has the uh, the paint on the window. There it is. Paint on the window. So, and then like I said, these two are just like slight, slight minor box damage on the outside. So. All right. Thank you guys so very much. I really appreciate the support. Um, the funds are going to go to a very good cause. I really appreciate that. Like I said, $3 is definitely, if you're able to, cool. If not, no worries. I've been talking about doing a raffle for some time now, so I just thought it'd be really cool. So I think my plan is I will do the, the I'll pick a winner in tomorrow's video, and that person will get this 50 plus valued per PPG mystery box for free. And again, keep in mind they're all damaged. So some damage Funko Pops. So let's do another giveaway, guys. What do you say? So this time I'm going to show you what the prize is. And then we I'll show you who we're shouting. So the next person that we are shouting is... Actually, no, I just did that completely backwards. I just said I'm going to show you what you're going to win. So here's what is up for grabs. I've never offered this before either. We're doing a whole bunch of new stuff that I've never done before. So we are offering a T-shirt. We're offering a T-shirt. And with the holidays fast approaching, you guys know that I'm a huge 90 fan. You guys know that I'm a huge Nickelodeon fan. I saw this at Walmart and I had to get it. So it is a size large, in case you're wondering, a size large. It is a Nickelodeon Christmas shirt just in time for the holidays. We've got Chucky. We've got Rocco. We've got Tommy. We've got Ram. We've got Simpy. We've got Reptar. Oh, I am Reptar. We've got Gerald. We've got Arnold. We've got Cat Dog. We've got Spunky. So size large. Holiday Nickelodeon shirt. It's extra zesty. It's extra crispy. It's unworn. Straight off the hanger from Walmart, guys. We've got a the first physical prize of the night. Amanda Sparkle won the entry into the mystery box giveaway. DJ Funko Hunter won a guaranteed promotion on my description in my videos as my Funko friend for the remainder of November and into... Halt, I am Raptor, and into December. So, this is the next present for grabs, guys. Nickelodeon holiday shirt, size large. You know me. I'll include some extra goodies as well. Probably some stickers, probably some pins, probably some buttons. Hey, Moxley. Is that John Moxley? John Moxley's Crazy Adventures. Hey. You like that shirt? Awesome, Sarah. I'm glad that you like it. Okay, so, the first physical shirt. You know that I'm all about extra zesty, <laughs> extra crispy shirts. So, that was pretty cool with the holidays. Nickelodeon. So, that'll be the next prize. So, here is who we are shouting out. We are shouting out someone who does do Funko, but 
they're not just Funko related products. So the account that we are going to shout out is called Jessie's Neverland. So she is a huge fan of Disney. She is a huge fan of pop culture. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to link her most recent video. And I just want you to go to her video and comment. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. So here is the link to the video, guys. That's the link to the video. And hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. So if you want to just comment that on her video, we'll give that about five, ten minutes. And then we will give away this extra zesty extra crispy Nickelodeon 90s shirt. Again, this is the first physical prize of the night. Again, it's not necessarily a Funko Pop channel, but she does awesome Disney stuff. So if you're a Disney fan, you are a Funko Pop fan, you're a collector. Um, I can see Michael wearing that shirt on a video. Trust me, this was hard not to keep for myself. But I was like, you know what? I saw this today. I said, this would be a cool prize to give away to somebody. So got them in. I'll give a little bit of a closer look. Gerald's got like a Santa hat on, or he's got Christmas lights in his head, on his hair. We got Reptar with the Christmas hat. We've got Tommy putting up the star. We've got Ren and Stimpy. We've got Chucky looking lost and confused per usual. We've got Rocco trying not to step on anyone's toes. we got uh, Spunky. We've got... I'm surprised that Spike and uh, Spunky aren't like together in the picture, but I thought that was super cool. So you know me. I'm all about the 90s. I'm all about Nickelodeon. So that is the next thing that we have up for grabs, people. So again... Go to Jesse's Neverland, support her, just comment on that video, hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me, and in about 5-10 minutes we will pull the winner for that extra zesty, extra crispy shirt, guys. Ooh, excuse me. So hopefully everyone's having a good night. Thank you again so much for being in the live stream, for being a part. And that's funny. Yeah, I definitely. That's that's so me. What's another another reason why I wanted to do it was because it's it's so me. Pause of purpose. Yes, agreed. Yes, Michael, you have some very amazing shirts as well, my friend. I am jealous of your shirt collection. Extra zesty, extra crispy. So again, hashtag Mikey Vintage me. Thank you, Mama J, so much for linking that up. Thanks for being an amazing mod as well as Sarah. Sarah, thank you for being an amazing mod. I very much appreciate that. Just getting the link to the video real quick. I'm not going to plug it in quite yet. So, again, real quick while we're waiting on that. Again, guys, it's DM me on Instagram. It's $3 for a raffle entry into potentially winning that mystery box. So, you've seen half of the box so far. So, there's still three more that you don't know about yet. So, Jelly of Mikey shirts. Yeah. Got to keep it extra crispy. Got to keep it fresh, people. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, she's a huge Disney fan. Uh, she loves pop. She loves pop culture. So she always shows me love on Instagram. She always shows my videos love. So I want to give back to her. Again, she has, just like everyone else we've shouted out thus far tonight, she has no idea that we're doing this. I did not tell her. Uh, I just thoroughly enjoy her content. So um, wanted to send some love her way. Um, so... Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, she she she's a fandom lover, much like us. So of course, had to showcase it, had to show her off. So she has no idea they were doing this. So I think that she definitely deserves a lot of love and support that is heading her way soon. So we'll give her about like another five minutes, and I'll pull a winner for that video, and that'll go towards the Nickelodeon shirts, the holiday hot cash for raffles. Oh my gosh! You know what? I actually thought about doing a hot topic gift card. Not gonna lie. I, well, actually, for, I take that back. I was thinking about doing hot cash, but hot cash expired yesterday or the day before, so that's no good anymore. Um, I'm pretty sure you can use hot cash online. I'm not for certain, but I'm pretty sure you can use hot cash online. But the hot cash expired. So then I thought, maybe I'll do a Hot Topic gift card, but I didn't have enough time to get a gift card and get it activated before the stream. So that's kind of where that shirt came into play. I knew I wanted to do at least four or five giveaways, so that's where that shirt came into play. When I was at Walmart getting that wrestling stuff, getting the, the Dead Man, the Undertaker, I saw that on the way out. I said, that would be a cool shirt. So again, it's a size large. It's... It's super stretchy material as well. It's not going to be like slim fitting. It's super, super. I don't know. I don't think it says like what brand it's printed on. No, it's, it just says Nickelodeon brand. It doesn't say what brand it's printed on. But again, guys, it's super stretchy, super comfy. I'm sure if you just wash it on low, it won't shrink. So a size large, I figured that was a standard. I didn't want to go too big, but I also didn't know if like a medium would be too small. I'm kind of a medium. 
I wear like, a, you know, you saw my video today, hashtag dad bod. So, um, didn't want it to be too snug, but I also didn't want it to be too loose fitting to wear was a pajama shirt for somebody. So I figured a size large was a good, uh, good alternative. So, like I said, we'll give it about five more minutes. We'll pull a comment from that video. Just want to send some epic, amazing love and support her way. So again, she has no idea that we're even doing this. So I thought that'd be super cool. Nobody that we're shouting out tonight. Um, Again, if you aren't following Poppins and Some Pops, please make sure that you're following Poppins and Some Pops. I really want to get them to 500 subscribers. If you aren't following Jerry over at Boon.Pops, quick reminder, please go follow him. Want to get him to his next milestone. I believe it's 400. We can do it, guys. I really sincerely appreciate you guys so much. Thank you so very much. I'm just getting, um, just getting a couple things together. Thank you again so far. For supporting uh, my friends Funko, even if they aren't into Funko Pops, thank you for supporting them and their loves and their passions and their fandoms. All right, I'm gonna grab her video real quick and get that link. Thank you guys so much for taking part. Very much appreciate that. That was her most recent video she just posted, I believe, uh, earlier today. Um, as you can tell, she's super passionate about her fandoms, especially like Disney and Mickey and. Harry Potter. That's another thing that she loves too. She loves Harry Potter. So, want to make sure that we shouted and promoted her as well. So, thank you guys so much for being epic. Thank you for being amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. So again, so like I said, so the that shirt's gonna be um, an awesome prize for somebody in the community. I hope that you'll enjoy it much like I enjoy my shirt. So I'm just pulling. That video up right now we'll give it about another two minutes and then we'll go ahead and pull a winner so again one more time guys while we're waiting three dollars dm me on instagram that gets you an entry into i and by the way it's payments on paypal that's the only kind of payment form i have right now is paypal i don't have vimo i don't have cash app i don't have facebook wallet unfortunately so that's via paypal um like i said i know that it's kind of tight because of the holidays, people are a little bit strapped. I understand that. So I wanted to make it inexpensive and affordable for everyone. So for essentially a $3 entry, you potentially could win a $50 plus damage mystery box. You already saw half of what's inside. So we'll do, I'll get a little bit more info. We'll dive into that a little bit later. So Jesse's Wonderland. We're going to pull that video up real quick. We'll get that linked up and then we'll find ourselves a winner for the shirt, guys. Well, I think I spelled this wrong. I did spell this wrong. No wonder why I can't find it. Same thing with the Supreme Carnage. When I was looking at the Supreme Carnage, there was like three or four. And I'm like, that's not the one. That's not the one. Yes, Michael, I know that you would. I know that you totally would. You absolutely would. We have that fat phone call pond. <laughs> Jerry, in your video recently, when you were like fat man bending over, I about died laughing. That was I was not expecting that. All right, why can't I find? Sorry, guys, I'm trying to find her video on my phone, and it's not. Oh, no wonder there's no space. Okay, duh. Okay, sorry. I linked the video, and I can't even. <laughs> I can't even find her. Okay, here we go. Jesse's Wonderland. I forgot that there's no space. All right, hold on. No, oh, Neverland, not Wonderland. Get it together, Michael. Gosh, Neverland. I'm looking up Wonderland. Oh, my Lanta. Neverland. Okay. Now we're cooking full. Sorry. First, I put looked up Jesse's Wonderland. Then I looked up Jesse's Wonderland with no space. And then I'm looking up Jesse's Neverland. Okay. Okay. We're getting there. Jesse's Neverland. Why am I not seeing her page on here? Sorry, guys. Four pack is back. What up? Four pack. Hoo -hoo. Welcome. Just shouting some channels, doing some giveaways. Why can I not find? Here, let me look up. Okay. Box lunch. Hot topic. Q 
KOHL apostrophe S. Sorry, guys. Taking a little bit longer than anticipated. Why am I not seeing her on here? That is so weird. Are her videos not available on mobile? That's so strange. I did this. I spelled it right. Jesse's Neverland. All right, guys, this is what we're going to do. It's not showing up on my phone, so I'm just going to do a random comment picker on here. I'm not able to screen rotate or screen grab, so I'm just going to do a random comment picker, and I will be 100% honest and transparent with you. I will let you guys know who won. So let me just pull that up real quick. So best of luck to everyone. So, again, this is um, – Brian, thank you so much. Very much appreciate you. Again, again, guys, if you aren't following Brian, Pops and some pops. I know most of the community already is. Please be sure to go – good luck, Brian. Be sure to go follow him, my friends. He's awesome. Let's get him to 500 subscribers. Hashtag road to 500. All right, so I'm just going to do a random comment picker, guys, and I will tell you 100% who won. All right, random YouTube comment picker. Um, I think the reason why is I think that she might be 17 or 18, so it might not be showing up on – mobile i'm thinking that might have something to do with it so all right so i've got the random comment picker up guys i'm grabbing the link from her youtube video you can even, you can probably even hear it playing in the background oh a few weeks ago maybe a month ago all right so thank and you everybody the regular price of it was 30 dollars. all right so we're grabbing the link right now for her video thank you everybody that took part thank you everybody that commented the hashtag so again the first one that comes back with um mikey vintage sent me um Gets the shirt. Okay, so get you two comments. All right. Did I link the right video? Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. <laughs> I'm just having all sorts of technical difficulties on this thing, guys. Sorry. It's telling me there's only two comments. That cannot be possible. All right. Let's see. Subscriptions. Actually, wait. Hold on. Thank you, everybody, for sticking there with me. Sorry, I did not realize that it wasn't going to show up on mobile. All right, here we go. Maybe I copied the wrong one. It's been on sale for maybe 17 or so, and I was like, uh. Okay, there's, what the heck? That is so, does it not, okay. Did it not let you guys comment? I'm thinking it didn't let you guys comment on the video because there's only two comments on here. That's so strange. Did I not, hold on. Did I not link her video in here, guys? I think, the, yeah, that's weird. It's saying that there's only two comments. That's so strange. Hmm. You know what? I wonder if she has to approve the comments. Or maybe. You know what? I guarantee you that's probably what it is. She probably has to approve the comments. Okay. Well, hmm. In that case. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, I'm trying to figure out what to do here now. All right, here's what we're going to do, guys. Here's a quick solution to this. So I want everybody in the chat right now to pick a number between 1 and 50. The first one that gets it gets the shirt, only because I don't know how else to do this because she. I think she has to approve the comments, and it's not letting me do a comment picker. So I appreciate you guys supporting her. So again, I think she has to either approve the comments or it's not showing up because of her age. I think she's 17, 18. I'm not really sure. But anyways, I wrote a number on a piece of paper. 1 through 50, the first one that gets it gets this shirt. I'm very sorry, guys. I didn't think this through, and it just didn't really, didn't really work out as I had planned. So sorry about that. Like I said, it's, it's literally only showing me that there's two comments. So I think she has to approve the comments, and I did not realize that. So, all right. So, whoa, we just had a lot of numbers fly in. Hold on. No, 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 Okay. So far, nobody has it yet. So, oh my God, more numbers, more numbers. Okay, Fox Crown, where you at? Fox Crown. Boom shakalaka. Boom shakalaka, people. Number 17. Fox Crown. Let me just make sure no one had, sorry, I had a lot of numbers flying in. Let me just make sure that I'm being fair here. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Hold the phone. Okay, hold on. 
Wow, that's a lot of numbers. Okay. Holy moly. That might not have been the <laughs> that might not have been the best idea because I just have like a full screen of numbers. Wow. -y. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. Peanut butter and fox crown had 17 at like the same time, at like the exact same time. So here's what we're gonna do. Okay. I bought this game earlier today at the dollar store. It's called Disney Meme. So I'm just going to pull a random card out of here. And between you guys, Frox Crown or Peanut Butter, whoever comes up with the best meme, the community decides, gets the shirt. Okay, so I'm going to pull a random card out of here. All right, so hold on. I need to find like an actual character card. Okay, here we go. Here's the card. It's Jesse from Toy Story. So your best meme or your best caption for this. So between Peanut Butter and Fox Crown, Whoever comes up with the best meme for this gets the shirt. Only because you guys both entered at the same time, and I didn't realize that that could even happen. I wasn't expecting, like, 2,000 numbers to fly at me at the same time. <laughs> All right, so Fox Crown, peanut butter. Let's hear it. Let's show it one more time. If it were me, I'd be like, reach for the sky. Uh-oh. What happened? Okay. Oh, uh, Fox Hunter, are you giving it to Peanut Butter? Okay. Uh, if Peanut Butter did have it first, I apologize. It came back at the same time on my end, so I was really trying to save a tree around a cowboy. Fox Hunter, are you are you gifting it to PB? I see Peanut Butter can have it. Are you gifting it to PB? Fox, I give it to Peanut Butter. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. So, Peanut Butter, the shirt is yours. Congratulations, my friend. And Fox Crown, for being such an awesome Funko friend and doing that, I'm going to give you a free entry into the Damage Mystery Box. So, I'm going to make a note of it right now. Thank you, Fox Crown. I apologize. I wasn't expecting all that to happen. And I was just trying to think of a quick solution because I didn't realize that the random comic picker wasn't going to work. So, Fox Crown, you will get a free entry, my friend, into the Funko Pop Mystery Box raffle. So, while we're talking about this stuff, guys, I found... Where did I put the box? So I actually found this at the dollar store. I know that they make, like, a full card version at Target of this meme game. But I thought this would be kind of cool to play a game with these guys. We'll just pull a couple of these out, and we'll just come up with some memes. I'll pull out, like, five of these. So I'll just pull out five random cards, and I want to hear your guys' best memes for the cards that we draw. Okay. So I'm not going to look at them. I'm just going to pull five. Make sure these are pictures. Okay, so we're going to pull five. Oh, wow, I did pull five random cards. That's awesome. Okay, so here's what we are going to do. All right, so. Okay, so I will show a picture. Thank you, everybody, for helping out on that. Like I said, I wasn't expecting, yeah. Thank you, Foxtron. I appreciate that. So, Peanut Butter, you are the winner of the shirt, my friend. And Foxtron, you will get an entry into my Damage Mystery Box. Thank you so much for being an awesome Funko friend. That was amazing of you to gift that to him. All right. So, here is the first meme, guys. Caption it. Comment it. What is it? It's Gaston from Beauty and the Beast. What is your, what is your caption? What is your meme for it? I seriously cannot believe this is only a buck. That's crazy. It says that there is... How many cards? Hold on. I think it says on top. Where did it go? It's on the back. Sorry. There's 52. 52 cards in here, it says. So, let's hear it, guys. Best line, best meme, best caption. Congratulations again, Peanut Butter. You probably haven't even seen, I don't know if you're watching or if you're just listening, but you want a shirt, my friend. You probably haven't seen it yet. Look at my shiny teeth. Cheers. Do I have food in my teeth? Queso. If it were me, what would I caption this? Oh, I know what I would caption this. <laughs> that feeling when the Chipotle hits. Ah! <laughs> oh, boy. Awesome. Awesome caption, guys. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. So, on to the next one. Oh, this is a good one. This is a good one. Are you ready, guys? Ready? Here we go. 
Caption it. Caption it or meme it. Let's hear it. Rafiki with Simba. Iconic. 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 Like I said, I cannot believe this is only a book. That's crazy. When you first get your braces off. All right. So, caption it, guys. Let's hear it. What's the caption for Rafiki and Simba? <laughs> awesome, my friend. Awesome, peanut butter. I did not realize that the shirt was going to be that popular. I guess I'll have to give more shirts away. What do you think, guys? Should I give more shirts away? Uh... In my lives and in my giveaways. One move, you're gone. When you are proud of your... Oh, my God. Pop out of the box. Awesome. That's funny. All right. So we got about three more. When they hand you your Chipotle burrito. Ah! If it were me... Okay, you guys remember that the scene in Peter Pan when Peter first gives them like the fairy dust and they fly out the window and it's like you can fly, you can fly, you can fly, you can fly. Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> Help free Simba take him back. He's nothing but trouble. Starting bed is at 15 melons. Catch. That's funny. Okay, so on to the next one, guys. Here we go. Next Disney meme is oh, another another iconic one. This one I think is on the box. They have this caption. Okay. It says the look, it says the look when you spot your crush. That's what the box says. Um, if it were me, I would say that feeling when you get the water park all to yourself. That would be my caption for that. <laughs> when I find an undamaged pop in the clearance section. <laughs> Oklahoma Bob. How's my breath? Oh my goodness, you guys. This is turning into like Funko After Dark over here with some of these comments. Good God. Oh my God. Okay, multiple people had the same caption. That, oh my God. Okay, I have to show this one. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. Okay. This is awesome. You guys are super creative. Yes, when you see the 10 inch Coca Cola bear. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys are so like minded. I love it. Okay. So thank you guys for that. On to the next one. We got two more. This is second to last one. All right. What is it? I think that's. What is this from? I know it's Thumper. Oh, is this from Bambi? Yeah, this is Bambi. At first, I thought that was the owl from Winnie the Pooh, but it's not. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> All right. So that's the owl from... So I'm pretty sure this is from Bambi. That owl looking creepy. <laughs> My reaction when I saw the 10-inch Hedwig... Owl staring back at me at night. That's my comment for that one. The feeling when the 10-inch is staring back at you. The 10-inch Funko Pop stares back at you in the night. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you guys are funny. I love it. I'm so... I literally, when I saw this... I would have paid more than a buck for this. When I saw this, I said, this is going to be so fun tonight. Ava Rooster, awesome. When I saw this, I said, this is going to be so fun. I cannot believe this was only a buck. What big eyes you have. I need your foot. It's good luck. You can't get me when someone watches you, creepy. Oh, what? What's this? What's this? There'll be two. We have two more giveaways. Yeah, we have two more giveaways still coming up. All right, so. When your mom comes home and you haven't cleaned the house, yes. Dancer TV, loving the new banner, my friend. Loving the new icon. <laughs> Lurkers looking out for hashtag and giveaway streams. 
All right. All right, you guys. So we got one more. We got one more, and I'll save the rest for probably the next time that we play this um, in, like, another live stream, or maybe I'll do it in a video. So those are pretty, those are pretty funny. All right. Let's see. I gotta put these back in order. Okay. I don't even know what that one's from. All right, so we got one more, guys. We got one more. All right. Oh, this is the this is the Lego figure that I pulled today. That's funny. So, what is the caption for that, guys? When you go to the store and all the damages, or excuse me, when you go Funko Pop hunting and it's all old selection or the pops are damaged. Let me know your meme or caption for that, guys. All right, thought that'd be super fun. Like I said, I found this at my Dollar Tree. So check out your local Dollar Tree. See if you can find this game. See if you can find those wrestling figures or those Power Rangers. I thought that would be super fun. Um, I'm going to stick these ones back in the box. We did not use these ones. Thank you, everybody, for taking part, for humoring me. That was That was funny. So yes, that was a buck at the Dollar Tree today at the Disney meme game. So we'll probably play that again another time. Okay, guys. So one more time. This is half the box for the Damage Mystery Box. Again, DM me on Instagram. It's $3 for an entry into the raffle. This is half of what the Damage Mystery Box is going to be. So with that being said, do you guys want to see one more pop from the box or do you want to see no more pops? So I'm either going to keep if we don't do any more pops, that means that three in here are going to be a mystery to whoever wins it. Or if we do one more, that means two of them are going to be a mystery because you'll have seen four. So let me know down below, guys. Zero or one? Zero or one? Do we want to see one more damage pop or do we want to see no more damage pops? I want there to be some mystery, so I'm going to keep at least two. But if we want to show one more, I will show one more. So one or zero, one or zero. Okay, so I've got two for no more. All right, so everyone's saying no more. So I'm okay with that. I'm okay with no more. So unless we get another zero. Okay, all right. So the majority have spoken. They said none. So this is half of the box. We've got the Roy with Predator mask. The damage is that there's paint on the inside window. The Daggett, you can see from the top, it's a little um, and then, oh, this is the one that I was thinking about right here in the middle. Can you see that right there in the middle? It's like a little, someone uh, someone kind of pushed in a little bit. Um, back's good, and then we have the Tiffany, so the, the lip of the bottom and the lip of the top have um box them so these this is half the box right here so this is half the box right here so again dm me on instagram it's three dollars i will enter you into the raffle and tomorrow i will pull a winner for that just thank you guys very very much sincerely appreciate that so let's do another giveaway guys sorry again about the um jesse's um neverland i didn't realize that the comments weren't going to work so these two i know that they will for sure work so here is the next channel that we are going to be shouting out let's find a video that doesn't have a whole lot of traffic and i will send you their way okay let's do this one let's do this one all right so the next account that we are going to shout out is Hold on, let me copy this link right real quick. All right, so the next pot, oh my gosh, the next channel that we are going to shout out is We Gotta Have Our Pops. We Gotta Have Our Pops. So here is the video below. Just comment on them. Mikey Vintage, on um, this one, put Mikey Vintage says hi. 
Mikey Vincent says hi on that video. Hashtag Mikey Vincent says hi. We'll get that about five, ten minutes, and then we'll pull a winner for that. Um, in the meantime, I can show you guys what is up for grabs just as soon as I find it. It is I'm pretty sure it's this one right here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this one right here. So, so thank you guys again so much for supporting my Funko friends. So as of right now, be sure if you like what you see, be sure to subscribe. And they have 176 subscribers. Let's see if we can't get them to 200. If not, that's okay. But I think that'd be a cool milestone for them to reach is 200. That's about what 15, 20, 25 away. Yeah, 25 away. Excuse me. So if we can, cool. If not, I know we bumped up quite a few people tonight. So. They are sitting at 176. Let's just refresh that real quick because I know you guys are probably working your magic. So on that video that I linked down below, just comment. Hashtag Mikey Vincent says hi. 180 subscribers. You guys are awesome sauce. Thank you so much. All right. So while you guys are doing that, I will show you what is in this box. So a video from last week is I went to McDonald's and I got some Happy Meal toys. So these Happy Meal toys sold out. But I have one unopened Happy Meal toy from 1996 so this this happy meal toy is unopened it's from 1996 however that's not the only thing in the box we also have a luna lovegood with her x-ray specs funko pop pez so for the person that i pull for the man and come and pick her they will get both these prizes a mcdonald's unopened happy meal toy from 1996 that will go towards you my mcdonald's has been sold out of these for days there's been a lot of pissed off parents there's been a lot of upset children that can't get a toy with their happy meal because of grown-up adults like myself trying to still act like kids taking all these happy meal toys sorry to the kids sorry to the children sorry <laughs> anyways so we got luna lovegood and her x-ray specs funko pop pez so the winner will get these two epic extra crispy prizes, guys. So that'll be in a sorter box, as you see. So again, let's just go show our Funko friends. We gotta have our pops. Show them some love. Comment hashtag Mikey Vintage says hi. Thank you guys so much. 184. You guys are amazing. You guys are awesome. Thank you so very much. Much appreciated. Yeah, I don't. I can tell you right now, I don't know what's inside. I haven't opened it. I thought that'd be a cool prize. I've kind of saved that in my car since I did my unboxing video. So it's extra zesty, extra crispy. You will be the first one to open it. Um, Amber, I'm glad you said that because I actually, I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it right there? We're going to do on a little field trip. I've got, let's get my hand out of the way. I've got the Furby right there. Can you see it? I've got the Furby right there with some Nickelodeon toys. So that Furby, I can tell you right now, I don't think it's the Furby because it doesn't feel like that's, I feel like that's probably one of the biggest toys that and the, the uh, Bugs Bunny with the basketball hoop. I don't think it's that, but I could be wrong. Again, it's a complete mystery, so I don't know for certain. So again, thank you guys so much for going over to their channel and supporting. We got to have our pops. Thank you, thank you so much. We'll give that about another five minutes. 185. You guys are incredible. Awesome. They're about 15 away from 200. So even if we don't get in that milestone, that's okay. Thank you guys so much for commenting, for supporting them. I'm just going to grab the link from their video real quick. We won't run that just yet. And then when we do, the winner will get that McDonald's unopened Happy Meal toy. And for those of you that didn't see my video, McDonald's is celebrating their 40th anniversary. So they're coming out with like old school toys. I've noticed that they're kind of like, remade toys they're not the same kind of toys they're a little bit like cheaper quality cheaper material they're not as big like i remember that furby literally used to like i don't remember if it was wind up i think you just like backed it up and it went on its own it doesn't do that you have to physically push it it's also smaller um and when you look at the bottom of the toys it says like 2019 if it was like the same kind of toy it would have the year it was made so essentially they're bringing back the same style and the same kind of ideas but it's not the same toy if that makes sense so but I thought that'd be super cool. And then that Luna Love Good Pez I've had for a while. So I want to pass the torch. I want to pass it to a good home. So, guys, real quick, thank you so much for supporting them. I just got to grab um, the their video real quick. And then I will link that up. Thank you so much for commenting on the video. Thank you guys so much for supporting them. You guys are awesome. You guys are incredible. Very much appreciate that. All right. Yeah, like I said, my... My McDonald's has been sold out for like a few days, at least a week now. When I went, 
the girl's like, you want to just buy the toys? And I didn't know if you could. I was like, I said, here's the dilemma. I don't want a Happy Meal, but I want the Happy Meal toys. Do you sell those individually? And she was like, yeah, I think so. I didn't know that they did that. So I found that out. So yeah, because of grown adults like myself, these children have not had Happy Meal toys all week. So the parents are pissed. I'm sure the kids are super pissed. All right. Let's grab their video real quick. E. All right. Let's make sure I'm grabbing the right video. Yes. Thank you guys again so very much. I very much appreciate you doing that. So, that, again, that's we got to have our pops. All right. All right. So, here's what I'm doing right now, guys. Get in the video. So we just got a couple things in the mail. I'm gonna go in. My phone call friends. All right, so we're gonna grab the link. All right, I'll give us about another 40 seconds. Another 40 seconds is comment that hashtag hashtag Mikey Vinci says hi on their video, and we will run the random comment picker, guys. Awesome. Sorry again about that previous giveaway. I'm not really sure what happened with that. Um, didn't really think that one through, but I think that one of the things that I mentioned that might have been what caused it. Um, she probably should approve the comments, or maybe it's because of her age. It doesn't allow it to show up on mobile, or maybe my phone was just acting up. I don't really know. So, all right, we're going to plug that in, get comments. All right, so we got 32 unique comments, guys. So, about another five seconds. All right. Everyone uses their phone. Go away. I hate, I get, I get that they have to do ads, but it's so annoying. Read Fox money. message. Simple, Did I miss something? Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I haven't drawn the winner yet. Hold on. Fox, what was it? I missed it. Sorry. What? What is it regarding the prize? Do you have a Do you have a Happy Meal toy as well that you're wanting to give away? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just going to scroll up in the chat because if so, I didn't see it. My dupes are still in bag. You'll match the win regarding the McDonald's toy. I have some McDonald's hoop glitz. Okay, so. I can't see you. Okay, so. Am I am I understanding you correctly? So you're offering a Happy Meal toy as well, along with mine, to the, to the person that wins? Is that what you're saying? I just want to make sure that we're understanding each other correctly before I pull this winner. Just said I will send a winner a Happy Meal toy. Okay, very awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much. Sorry, I apologize that I didn't see that. I was grabbing the link to the video. My apologies. Okay, so so Foxconn is going to also send a Happy Meal toy to whoever the winner is. So, again, guys, let's just refresh this one more time. So, we've got 32 unique comments. So, let's see who's getting a Luna Love Good Pez and two Happy Meal toys. One for myself, Kenneth Bird. Congratulations, Kenneth Bird. You're on the way to two Happy Meal toys and a Luna Lovegood Funko Pop Pez. Congrats, my friend. Let me mark that down. All right. So all winners thus far have been noted. Sorry about my chicken scratch handwriting, but there it is. All right. But PB has to give my Effie shirt back. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you, Fox, so much for doing that. Very much appreciated. That was very kind of you to do that. Congrats to the winner. Let me unpin this. All right, guys. So we're at about an hour and a half right now. So we're going to wrap this up. I still have one more giveaway. So um, thank you, everybody, so much for helping put me on the road to 350 subscribers. I super appreciate all of you guys. I also appreciate all you guys with your time on my videos, in my comments, on social media. So one last time, guys. Reach out to me. This is the actual box right here. There's six pops inside. So for $3, just $3, you can enter into the raffle for the Funko Pop Damage Mystery Box. You've seen half the box. So one last time. This is your last chance. One or zero. Do you guys want to see any more pops in the box or do you want the other three to be a mystery? Just comment one or zero. The majority will roll. And this is it. I won't I won't brag about the box anymore. Um, so like I said, $3. The PPG price, as of this morning, it's $50-plus in return value 
for this box. So for essentially only $3, you could potentially win this box. There's no limit. There's no cap. There's no max. You can enter as many times as you want. It's just $3 for an entry, and I accept payment via PayPal. So what's ah. Once again, congratulations, Kenneth Bird. I still have that up. I was looking at it. So congratulations. Zero. Okay. So <laughs> done, done, and done. So you saw the three pops. It is what it is. The other three pops will be a complete mystery. So the person will get a genuine, true to form mystery box. So three of the pops, all the pops have very minor to significant damage. I just want to double check and make sure. So no more pops will be shown. So one last time $3 gets you entered into the raffle for the mystery box. So here is my plan on that. And after this, I'll stop flapping my gums and we'll do one last giveaway and then we'll wrap it up. So 50 plus dollars in return value in this box. So for $3 an entry, you could potentially win. I accept payments via PayPal. So here's what I plan to do. For every entry, for every entry a person has, your name will get put onto a random wheel with your name. So uh, say you have three entries, your name gets put on the wheel, three individual places, three individual times. Say you have five entries, your name gets put on the wheel five individual times. So I'm going to spin the wheel with as many names as show up on there. And the first person that it lands on essentially gets that box. So even if you only enter one time, even if you enter three times, even if you enter five times, everyone has a fair and honest and equal chance. And so honestly, when I say damage, I've literally inspected all these. There's there's minor box damage. I think there's only one that has like major box damage, but it's not, it's like the back is like kind of caved in a little bit. It's not, it's not horrible. It's not horrible. So if you've watched my videos recently, you've seen some of the potentials of what it could be. So again, there's three that are a mystery. So tomorrow I will tally up. So we'll say tomorrow by noon, tomorrow by noon, that'll be the cutoff. You cannot enter anymore after tomorrow at noon. So between tonight, message me on Instagram right now, I accept payments via PayPal. So up until noon tomorrow, you have to enter. So at noon, I will add all the names to the wheel. I will film a video and we will do it live. And the first person that it lands on will get that mystery box. So even if you enter once, even if you enter three times, if you enter five times, if you enter 10 times. So it's $3 per entry, 50 plus dollars per PBG. I checked the value. I've been talking about doing a giveaway like this. I've been talking about doing a raffle, so I thought this would be super awesome. I want to give back to you guys. You know, I've done a lot of like damage mystery boxes this month, so I thought this would be really cool. So essentially, even if you only enter one time, you have just as much of a chance as someone that enters five, ten times. So the more the merrier. It all will go towards a great cause. Um, so thank you guys so very much. If there's anything else that you guys want to say, please feel free to do so now. We have one more giveaway to get to. Um, Thank you so much again, everybody. Thank you so much for coming out to the live. Thank you so much for supporting me. Thank you for putting me on the road to 350 subscribers. Like I said, guys, starting these videos was just a side hobby of mine. I had no idea that I would get this type of support. You guys are super awesome. Just thank you guys so much. I very much appreciate that. Whether you comment on Instagram, you reach out to me on social media, whether you comment on my videos, whether you're here in my live stream right now, whether you take part in mystery boxes that I've done, whether you take part in these raffles, which I want to, this is the first, if this goes well, I will definitely do more raffles. I'm thinking about doing Instagram raffles, but I want to see how this goes first. So $3 an entry payment on PayPal. So just thank you guys so much. We still have one more giveaway to get to tonight. And then I will, I will take entries all night long on Instagram. I'll take entries up until noon tomorrow. And then at that point I will stop it. I will cap it off. All the names will go into a wheel. So, you know, if you enter five times, you get five individual spots. If you enter 10 times, if you enter one time, you're on the wheel. So I just want to say thank you so much, everybody, sincerely for your support. Thank you for supporting our Funko friends tonight in the community. Um, you know what, guys? Let's do two more giveaways. What do you say? Let's do two more giveaways. So we're going to shout two more channels, and then we'll kind of wrap it up. So here is what we are going to do. For this giveaway, I'll show you what it is, and then I'll show you guys how to enter. So we're going to shout another channel, but for this giveaway, we have two Pocket Pops. We have a Crossbones from Captain America Civil War Pocket Pop unopened, and we have a Pennywise from It. He's holding... I'm not entirely sure what he's holding, but he's holding something. Oh, the beaver hat. Okay, so this must be from the new Pennywise. So we got Pennywise and beaver hat, and we've got the Crossbones from... 
Captain America Civil War. And there's one more thing that's going to go with this. We have, you saw me unbag some Legos today. We have a Star Wars Dark Vader unopened Lego pack. So this is the prize pack. So I'm going to stick that up here. So this is what we're going to do. Right there. So we are going to go to my good friend, Skittles Freak, Dylan, over at Skittles, Skittles Freak. If you like what you see, be sure to subscribe to him. It's not necessary, but if you would like to, I'm sure he would appreciate the support. I would like the support. But go to this video that I'm about to link down below and just put comment, hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. Dylan's super awesome. He makes funny videos. He's a super awesome member of the community. So if you like what you see, subscribe to him. Comment on the video, hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. I'll let that run for about five, 10 minutes, and we'll pull a winner from that. And then we'll do one more prize because there's one more channel that I really want to shout and promote. And then, like I said, if you want to get entered into that raffle, just DM me on Instagram. I accept payments through PayPal. $3 an entry gets you in. We'll do a random comment wheel. And tomorrow we will find a winner for that 50 plus per PPG damage mystery box. I sorry that I keep plugging it, but I'm just so excited. You guys have been asking for raffles. I'm finally doing a raffle. I thought this would be a very appealing thing to do. So right now, Skittle Streak, Dylan, link the video down below. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. We'll show that off one more time. We've got the Crossbones, Civil War, Captain America, Pocket Pop. We got the Pennywise with Beaver Hat. And we. Got the Darth Vader unopened. You can see, you can kind of see some of the pieces. At least this comes in like a little canister. That's kind of cool. The other Legos didn't have them. This is a bigger pack. So it comes in a canister so that you can keep all the pieces together. So this is unopened. You'll be the first person to open this. So this will be the second to last giveaway that we'll be doing tonight. And then we have one more that I want to do. All right. So thank you guys so much for for supporting my Funko friends. Thanks for hanging out with me in this live stream. Thank you for supporting other fellow Funko friends. You guys are awesome. You guys are amazing. You guys are incredible. Congrats to all the winners thus Welcome far. Back. Again, yeah. Fox Crown, I did not forget to enter you into the, so you're definitely going to be in there, buddy. So we've got Amanda Sparkle. She gets an entry. Fox Crown gets an entry. DJ Funko Hunter. He gets promoted on all of my videos in the description from now until the end of December. Kenneth Bird, you just won the... Oh, you know what? I just realized I didn't put peanut butter on here. My bad. Okay, so PB. Peanut butter gets the Nickelodeon shirt. All right, you're written down now. Peanut butter. Yeah. So peanut butter's on there for the shirt. And then Kenneth Bird, you are on there as well, my friend. So I have... All the giveaway winners thus far. We're going to add two more down to the bottom of the list. Like I said, guys, just want to spread the love, give back, share within the community, help out Funko Friends, help support this channel. Thank you very much, Amber. Thank you, everybody, very much. I did not realize that Pocket could possibly be the sought after, nor did I realize that a Nickelodeon trip would be that sought after, but you guys are awesome. I like sharing this kind of stuff with you guys, and it's clear that you guys enjoy a lot of the same things that I do. So that's super fun. That's super awesome, super amazing, super incredible. We'll give that about another two or three minutes on his video, and then we'll well, guys, pull well. a random comment from the video. Just thank you guys so much for being the awesome extra zesty community that you are. Hopefully, like I said, if you like what you see, subscribe to him. My boy Dylan, he's super funny, super. All right. Man, claws are coming out for that Pennywise. I like this one too. What was your favorite Captain America movie? A lot of people say Civil War. A lot of people say, uh, I don't know. Cool character. So we got the Captain America. We got the Crossbones. We got the Pennywise with Beaver Hat. We've got the In Bag in Box. Darth Vader. And then after this, we'll have one more giveaway, and then we'll have the we'll have the closing ceremony. Why is Fox's name not written down? It is. It's right here. Fox Crown. Right here. Fox Crown. So Amanda won the entry. Fox Crown won the entry. DJ Funko Hunter is going to be in description of my videos from here to December. 
Kenneth Bird won, and then Peanut Butter. I forgot to add Peanut Butter. That's who I forgot to win. So Peanut Butter's on there. So then whoever wins this one. Um, so he has an entry. So Amanda Sparkle has an entry. All right. So while you guys are doing that, thank you so much. I'm going to grab the link from that video real quick. We'll do that giveaway. We'll have one more giveaway, and then we'll have the <laughs> closing ceremonies, so to speak. Just thank you guys so much. It's been so much fun. We're approaching on the two-hour mark. I don't really like to step on anyone's toes or intrude on any other live streams. So um, we'll wrap this up in about 10 minutes. So, again, one last time, then I'll stop plugging it. $3 enters you into the Funko Pop raffle for that damage mystery box. $50 plus dollars, PPG. I only accept payment on PayPal. Just DM me you have between now and noon. Let me know, guys. All right, so let's go to YouTube. Let's grab Dylan's video. We'll grab a winner for that. We'll grab we'll, we'll shout one more channel. So again, guys, these people have no idea that I'm shouting them. They have no idea about all this love and support in the community that's about to head their way. So, so thank you guys so much for supporting myself. Thank you for supporting them. Thank you guys for giving back. All right. All right, just grab the link from his video real quick. What's up, guys? Once again, welcome back. What's up, Anyways. guys? All right. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I took a trip to Barnes and Noble. All right. Grabbing the link right now. Thank you for those of you that did comment. Thank you for those that did subscribe. All right, grab the link right now, guys. Grabbing the link from Dylan's video. Share. Grabbing it. Going over to the random comment picker. All right, guys, here we go. We're going to plug it in and we're going to find ourselves a winner. Oh. All right, here we go. Plug it in. All right. Get comments. 27 new comments. So, First one that comes back, Mikey Vintage with the hashtag will be the winner. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Um, there's there's nothing there. That's weird. Okay, so we're gonna pick another winner because I'm not really sure what happened there. Oh, do do. Hey, Oklahoma Bob, I know that you're in here. Cool minis. Awesome. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. Congratulations, Oklahoma Bob. Marking you down right now. All right, Oklahoma Bob. Thank you so much, everybody. Just thank you sincerely so very much. Okay, so before we get into this last giveaway, just real quick, like I said, thank you guys so much for taking time out of your night to join in my live stream. Thank you so much for helping myself and my Funko friends thrive and succeed it's because of you guys without you guys there is no us if that makes sense if there wasn't any anyone that cared anyone that like wanted to watch this kind of content we would have no reason to produce this kind of content so thank you guys so much for being the amazing epic extra zesty extra crispy funko pop community that you guys are one last time if you're not following boondock pops please go support jerry over boondock pops i know most of the community already is Go follow Amber over at Amber the Collector. She's super awesome. Thank you to all my mods very much. Thank you, everybody that has won thus far. We still have one giveaway. I'm not leaving just yet. And make sure to go follow Pop and Some Pops too, because they are so close to 500. Let's see. Actually, you know what? While we're thinking about it, where are they at right now? I want to see. Let's see where Boondock is and let's see where. Um, all right. So Boondock is four away from 400. We can get him there. If you, I know a lot of the community already is following him. If you aren't, Please be sure to go follow him. And then let's see where Pop and Sons are at. So thank you so much, Amber the Collector. Thank you so much, Mama J, Sarah, all my mods. All right, so Pop and Sons are five away from 500. Like I said, I know most of the community are already following both of them. But if you aren't, please make sure to go follow them. They are super awesome. They are super incredible. Um, super amazing. So, all right. So just thank you guys so much for taking time out of your night to be in my live. Congratulations so much to the winner. Delaney, hey guys, look at this. Boom shakalaka. Delaney, love you. So much love. You are an absolute gem. You are a bright, shining, radiant light in so many lives, including mine. Thank you so much. I wanted to send so much love and support and feedback and just friends your way. So everyone, meet Delaney. Go check out Delaney. Follow her on Instagram. Follow her on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for sh for helping me out. Delaney is awesome. Appreciate you very much. So thank you so much for popping in. I super appreciate it. She had no idea that we were doing this, guys. So 
you have so much love and support and just kind people heading your way. You don't even know. So congratulations to everybody. Congratulations to all the winners. Um, thank you so very much. Uh, thank you so much for taking time out of your night. We are on the road to 350 subscribers, people. One last time, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna plug it. You already know the deal with the Funko Pop raffle. Just get with me. You have till noon tomorrow. Thank you so much, everybody. All right, so we have one last extra crispy, extra zesty giveaway. So here is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show you who we're shouting. I'm gonna pull a winner, and then I'm gonna show you what you want. We're gonna do things a little bit differently this time around. So I've shown you who we're going to shout, and then I've shown you the prize. Then we pulled a winner. I pulled a winner, showed who we're going to show. And then so this time what we're going to do is I'm going to sh- I'm gonna link a channel. This person has no idea that I'm doing this. This person has no idea that we're about to send this love and support and feedback their way. I will pick a winner, and then I will show you what you want. Okay. So we are going to go to the channel, Hey, It's Katie. So this is the video down below. I want you to comment hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. If you like what you see, please subscribe to her. Please comment on her video. Welcome back, Dane. Welcome back, Gilbert. Um, yeah, unfortunately, we're going on about two hours now, so I didn't want it to be too long. I really appreciate you being here when you could. I appreciate everyone you know, coming in and out. I know that there's other people that are having their lives tonight, so I don't want to step on anybody's so toes. We'll wrap this up in about five minutes or so. So I'll give everyone about like three minutes to do the thing. So again, hey, it's Katie. Hashtag Mikey Vintage sent me. If you like what you see, go subscribe to her. She has like the most insane DC Funko Pop collection that I have ever seen in my entire life. And I am super jelly of it. She has so many epic, extra zesty, extra crispy grails in her collection. Katie, you rock. You're amazing. So sending so much love your way. She has no idea that we're doing this. So that's one of the things I want to do tonight is send so much love all these people's way. They had no idea. Um, you know, we shouted Delaney. We shouted Dylan over at Skills Freak. You know, again, follow Jerry at Boondock Pops if you're not. Follow Brian and Aiden over at Pops and Pops if you aren't already. So thank you so much. We'll give that about another two minutes or so, and then we'll pull a winner for that. You guys are just, like I said, incredible, blowing my mind. I super appreciate each and every single one of you for being amazing Funko friends, for taking time out of your night to do this for me, to help our friends, to support them, to just help my friends and our friends thrive, and grow, and succeed. Thank you guys so, 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 so very much. I appreciate it. I know all the people tonight appreciate it. Congratulations to all the winners thus far. I'll be sure to write the final winner down here um, and just get with me on Instagram. Uh, some of these people, I have their address already because they've won prizes for me before. So, again, just to recap while everyone's doing their thing. So, Amanda gets a free entry. Funko Crown gets a free entry. DJ Funko Hunter is going to be part of my Funko friends. His channel will be linked in all of my videos from the rest of the month up until December. Kenneth Bird, you are also receiving a prize. My friend PB is getting the shirt. And then Oklahoma Bob is getting the Legos and the um, the Mystery Minis. And then I couldn't remember what Kenneth Bird was getting. Sorry, Kenneth Bird is getting the, the Luna Lovegood with the X-Ray Specs and the two McDonald's Happy Meal prizes guys so again we're gonna do this a little bit differently i'm gonna tell you who won once i pull the winner and then i'm gonna show you what you want so we'll give that about another minute or so we'll pull a winner i'll show you the prize and then we'll get it wrapped up guys so let me go ahead and just grab her video real quick and then we'll pull the comment and then we'll wrap it up guys thank you so much for supporting all my funko friends thank you for supporting hey it's katie she's super awesome her collection just blows my damn mind it's insane in the membrane all right so hey it's katie you guys are awesome you are incredible you got these people to amazing milestones in no time at all this is why I love doing streams. This is why I love the community because you guys rally together and you help one another Thanks. and it all comes full circle. You help me by being here in the stream and supporting me. You help my Funko friends by giving them views, them love, them subscriptions. You guys get reward in return because you get new Funko friends. You get prizes. You get giveaways. You get informed about things that I do like my raffles. So, it's Katie. I've been having a great week so far. Uh, Today, I I love her accent. I just have to say that. I love her accent. I love her collection. Okay, so we're going to copy the link right now, guys. Copying the link. All right. So 
this will be the last giveaway for tonight, guys, and then we're going to wrap it up. We're going to close up shop. Thank you so much, everybody, again for your support, for putting me on the road to 350 subscribers. I super appreciate it. Thank you for making what was a fun hobby and even more activity and fun hobby for me. Very much appreciate it. All right, so we got 37 unique comments on the video, guys. This will be the last giveaway for tonight. Thank you so much. Here we go. So from the Hey, It's Katie video, we're going to find the winner, and then I'm going to show you what you won. Let's see. Oh, this is not. This does not have a hashtag. This is a completely different comment. So we're gonna pick another one, guys. Let's pick another winner. Here we go. So we're looking for hashtag. Mikey Vintage sent me. Here we go, guys. Nope. Still no hashtag. Third time's a charm. Hopefully, here we go, guys. It's hard to find a video that doesn't have a lot of comments on it already because this is what typically happens. Bootleg heroes. Oh man. That's my man, but still no hashtag. Sorry, bootleg heroes. All right, so four times the charm, maybe. Come on, big money, big money, big money, big money. No whammy. Lisa Pavlis, awesome. Hashtag Mary Gibbons sent me. Love all the Batman pops. She will love that comment. I love your support. She will love all this love and support that's heading away. So Lisa Pavlis, thank you so much for your support. Let me write that down so I don't forget. So let me write down the winner, and then I'm going to show you what you won. So here's what I can tell you. What you just won is on the back wall behind me. It's something on the back wall behind me. So it's coming out of frame. It's coming out of my videos and it's coming your way. So real quick. So it's something in the background. So Lisa Pavlis right there. You are the final winner. So we've got Lisa Pavlis, Oklahoma Bob, Peanut Butter, Kenneth Bird, Fox Crown, DJ Funko Hunter, and Amanda Sparkle. Congratulations to all the winners. Thank you guys so very much. So before we wrap this up, you guys probably want to know what you want. So, for Lisa Pavlis, we have the Dwight True Walmart exclusive Office Funko Pop, Dwight the Hay King, super awesome, super amazing. This exclusive is leaving my casa, coming to your casa. Congratulations. Just thank you guys so very much. I really sincerely appreciate each and every single one of you more than I can begin to explain. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day. Thank you for supporting myself, my Funko friends. Thank you guys once again for turning what was a fun little side hobby into my amazing creative endeavor. Like I cannot thank you guys enough. So I love doing stuff like this. It comes full circle. You guys support me. I support you guys. I support other Funko friends in the community. It all comes full circle. So thank you guys so very much for helping my Funko friends. Thank you for taking time out of your night to be in my live stream. Everybody, get, lot, winners, get with me. Again, one last time, if you want to enter the raffle, DM me. You know what to do. Thank you guys so much. Everybody, thank you so much. I love all your faces. Mikey Vintage signing off. Happy hunting. Collect what you love. Enjoy the thrill of the hunt. And until next time, guys, Mikey Vintage signing off. Bye, guys.